Hey there, I'm Pastor Brian, and it's time for questions from kids. Brayden from Pierre, South Dakota asks, Is God involved in everything, or do things just happen by chance? Brayden, let me give you the big answer to that, and then maybe drill down it and try to explain a little bit more. The answer is this, God is involved in everything. Uh, God is sovereign. That's the, the fancy theology word for it. That means he's in control of everything and he works providentially. There's another big theology word for you. That means that he's involved in everything to bring about what he wants to bring about. So nothing happens without him knowing about it. Nothing happens outside of his control. You know, you see that in today's story, don't you? The, the story of Esther. If you read through the entire book of Esther, and you can do that in one sitting, it's not really long. Just read through it and just notice how many times it seems like things just happen by chance. You know, somebody happened to be in the right place at the right time. Uh, something good just happened. No, it didn't just happen. It didn't happen by chance. Esther shows us that God was involved. He was bringing the situation to pass so that Esther could step in and save God's people. God was behind the scenes doing all that. That's one of the big takeaways of Esther. The Bible is full of that. You look at the stories of the Bible and over and over again, we see that God is in control. The prophecies we've been seeing about the coming of the Messiah in the Old Testament prophecies, those are evidence that God was orchestrating. He was bringing these things to pass. So everything in our lives is under his control. Now you may ask, well, then why do bad things happen? And that is simply because we live in a broken, fallen world and God still gives us the freedom to choose to do things and many times we choose to do what's wrong. He's in control of that, but we choose to do what's wrong. It's a tension there, it's a mystery how those things work together, but it's what the Bible teaches, it's what we have to understand and we just have to live that out. Understanding I am responsible for choosing to obey Him and then God is in control, nothing happens outside of his awareness and his authority. So find comfort in that. And at the same time, be encouraged to seek to obey God and to use the freedom he's given you for his glory. So here's a question back for you. How can understanding God's involvement in everything change how you think about or react to things that happen?